A multinational delegation led by Nobel Prize winner Merit Maguire is in the Lebanese capital Beirut to say no to violence in Syria. Maguire, who earned her fame for leading million-man marches throughout Ireland and England back in the 80s to oppose the British government's emergency laws, is now heading a group of international advocates, religious figures and activists from different countries to voice their concern over the ongoing unrest in Syria. The Syrian people are very, very capable of solving their own problems through dialogue, through negotiation. They can do that. But they must be allowed to do that. They have a right to sovereignty, to their own self-determination, as every people have. There is an unholy alliance uh, between uh, uh, some part of the international community that call itself uh, democratic and free world. And those movements that come uh, from beyond the history and uh, convey infra-human values. Not only Christians, uh, but uh, all the minorities uh, are in danger. The Syrian ambassador stressed that Israel's recent airstrikes targeting a research center in a suburb of the Syrian capital, Damascus, has mirrored the true face of terror standing behind the armed gangs in Syria and reflects the terrorist military objectives. The Israeli attack is a sign of a terrorist frustration on a battlefield and to us, it's an indication that victory is near. The Arab and international public opinion are awakening now to see why Syria is really being targeted and by whom. As for Israel, it's well aware that Syria won't pass its aggression pass by. The response is planned and will happen in the right time and place. The delegation's next stop was the Iranian embassy in Beirut, where they were received by Iran's ambassador to Lebanon, Ghazan Farouk Nabadi who reiterated his country's stance of what he described as a cosmic war on Syria. After meeting Syrian refugees in Lebanon, Lebanese lawmakers, as well as Iran's and Syria's ambassadors, the delegation is expected to fly to Damascus to meet both Syrian officials and religious figures. The advocates of peace who have come to express their solidarity with the Syrian people have warned that the consequences of destabilizing Syria are magnum and will fall on the shoulders of the entire region. They stressed that those standing behind the violence in Syria have stood previously behind destabilizing all of Iraq and Afghanistan. And so it's very important that the people of the region know the root of the problem to avoid falling in the same trap yet a newer time. Altaf Ahmed Press TV, Beirut.